Hi, I'm Jolene Montgomery, and I wanted to tell you about a few things I've learned about hand and body and eye position while running barrels. Um, a lot of different theories, a lot of different styles. I'm just going to share with you what I do. Okay. First of all, um, anytime I'm riding, I like to sit square in the middle of my horse, sit up straight, feet below me, heels down, just proper horsemanship in general. Um, I like to keep my hands about a foot apart, one on each side of their neck, just riding around in general. And um, it doesn't change much when I'm running the pattern. First of all, when I'm running the barrels, between the barrels, my upper body is leaned forward a little bit and I may be slightly out of the saddle, but I don't mean like up over their ears, standing up in my stirrups, just a little bit to urge them forward. And in between the barrels, my hand position barely changes. I move my hands forward a little to ask the horse to go forward, but I don't pick up on either side of their head like so. Um, and the reason for that is I see a lot of people, and sometimes it works, but I see a lot of people run into the first barrel like this. To me, all you're doing is slowing your horse down. Um, the fastest way a horse can run is free-headed straight ahead. So that's how I am between the barrels. Just straight ahead, maybe body slightly forward. And I'm looking forward, but when I get close to the barrel, I do look towards the barrel. Um, I don't know, some people say don't look at the barrel. I kind of like to watch where I'm going, but anyway. So straight ahead till I get to the barrel. Coming into the barrel, I may sit back just a hair if I don't feel my horse rating already, um, but nothing drastic. I just kind of move my upper body back just a hair. Coming into the barrel, come around. A lot of times on the back side of the barrel right here, I'll kind of turn like this and stand up in that stirrup. Um, I think it just shifts my weight enough to help my horse around the backside. And I'm not gonna lie, also I'm really close about to hit the barrel, so a lot of times I have to do that to miss hitting it. Um, anyway, same thing on all three barrels. Straight across. And I'm looking ooh, either kind of towards the barrel or at my horse's head. Um, all my barrel racing pictures, you can see it looks like I'm looking straight down at the barrel. Um, really, I think I'm looking at my horse's ears to see what my horse is doing so I can react to that. And I come straight up here. At this point, I'm, I'm looking towards the barrel a little bit. Like I said, I want to know where I'm going. And then ask him to come in. Lean forward just a little bit. Leaving. And as far as hands, um, when I'm running barrels, like I said, between the barrels, straight forward. When I'm approaching, especially the second barrel, the second barrel can be pretty tricky. Of course, I'm wanting him to go straight. I've trained him to go straight, but that doesn't always happen. I don't ever try to lift, because when I pull in this rein to my horses, that means turn. So, I come across here. If we're cutting in a little bit, I will bump the outside rein over. Um, you know, there's many arguments that that's going to make them drop their shoulder. I don't know. Maybe it does. But when I'm in competition, I'm going to do whatever I can to win. But that being said, if you ride around two-handed all the time, and I use this rein to bump them over all the time. So they're used to that. So that means something. Just like I showed y'all earlier when I'm flexing them. I don't lift to flex, I bump over. And that's why it works for me in the pattern. So if he's getting in too close, I might bump a couple of times and then drop to one rein. And I'm in the turn, I'm not pulling hard, I'm just right here. And like I said at the first barrel, around the back side, I kind of turn and face and finish the barrel. Um, and I'll just kind of go up to the first barrel once and show you a little bit at speed, see if we can catch it. He 
he's not warmed up just great, so I hope this works out. Straight ahead to the barrel. Turn and face, just like so. Do it again, bump, bump. Oops. Anyway, we weren't going fast enough to get around it, but I hope you can see in the video, the backside, I do turn and face. Coming in, I do bump out a lot of times. Um, my horses are used to it, so it works out. 